very disciplined. He put an incredible pressure. It's a pressure that makes his opponent panic. They don't know what to do. He's a guy that you're, you gotta beat him. He ain't gonna beat himself. You gotta, you gotta bring it. He's not just a puncher. He can actually box as well. He's got good footwork as well. He's 18 and 0. 19 victories, 19 knockouts. With 18 knockouts. You know, uh, every fight like different, different feelings, different uh, preparation, and it's. Fight, fighters too are different, you know, it's, it's, it's not bad, like, you know, I can't say I did a very bad fight, but if I do again, I want to do better, you know, but I feel good because I'm seen and I do relax. It's the pressure that he brings round after round that takes time, he evaporates you, and it takes time to do that. His hand speed, the, the technique of his punches, like everything, and his fucking strength, man. I'm anxious to get in there with him because a lot of people consider him the best in the division right now. He's overwhelming you. There is no respect. Yeah. There is no respect for what's coming back. And you've got to make sure you are deterred. You know, he's got, you've got to be able to deter him with your, um, with your ability, your movement, and obviously your punch power to a certain extent. Boxing alone is not going to keep him off. dude is fucking terrifying. <laughs> terrifying, because Joe Smith Jr. is an animal. I mean, he's this big, power-punching light heavyweight, and Bitter Bia fucked him up in two rounds. Dude was, a, was an Olympian. At the, he fought as, a, as a, an Olympian in a higher weight class. Right, everybody did up. Like, he's a, he's a big guy striking down. That's why he's so damn strong. Or Bitter Bia... The jab was important to give him cover when he does come forward, you know, to uh, kind of like uh, having a smoke screen as you come forward, you know, to block the guy's vision a little bit, make it harder for him to take pot shots at you. Honestly, if they part and I had to bet my money, I would probably say Arthur is punching power. I'd probably put Arthur in number one. My father is... He never like box until I won a bronze medal junior championship. And my father's friends, my all family friends, they all come to our house and do congratulations to my father. He tells me after that, yeah, if you like box, go. Of course it was against his religion, but he took his gun along. 
he got himself some very fine quail and one big measly hare. And on his way returning home, he met a great big grizzly bear. 